Hello everybody and welcome back to a brand new gameplay episode of Top Drives. In today's episode we are doing the Old Guard British Racers. I feel as if though this will be just as easy as the German one before so I'm not really worrying here. We have 20 rounds and then a ceramic pack of course to claim and we are going to be doing this uh, and getting it done I think quite easily. Uh, I hope so at least because the last challenge we did that was like the ceramic challenge was just incredibly easy so I would be highly surprised if this was any different um, okay um, however this is already more difficult starting off I must say already more difficult than the other one Oh, nice. I love this one when nothing loads in. Okay, thank you. <laughs> uh, but yeah, hopefully the first 10 rounds will be just uh, just dandy and skippable. And we should be all good. This is low, right? Yeah. Uh, this is medium as well. Yeah, very good. Okay. So, to start off, it's going quite well, um, no major problems. I do have quite a lot of British cars for this competition, so that's what's making me a little bit more, you know, uh, a little bit more optimistic, uh, so to speak, for this uh, challenge, because I feel as though I have the cars, so hopefully I do. Um, if you guys do enjoy videos like this and you want to uh, catch all of the other Old Guard videos, you don't want to miss out on them, of course, then please subscribe to the channel. Also, I have a goal to try to reach 10,000 subscribers and we are so very close. We are under 900 away, so that would be absolutely amazing if you guys would be so kind to subscribe. Uh, I would be very, very, very thankful for that. Um... Let us figure this out. That's easy peasy. We're moving on now to round number five. That's a fourth of the way in if we can manage to do it, which it looks very much like we will be able to. Um, so that's nice. That is it right there. And also, of course, as always, let me know how you guys did in this British Racers event. Did you do as well as me? Did you complete all of it? Or did you run into some issues that made you not be able to progress any further? We now have a lot more points. And I think we should get a completely new hand in to kind of, uh, you know, uh, shine through that we have uh, so much more RQ to use here. So there we go. That can go there, that can go there, um, that can go there, there, there. I maxed out two of the Lotuses because I think they are actually kind of good, the Elisas. I think they are actually kind of good still at 44 or wherever they are. Uh, I think they are kind of good cars even here. So because of that, I maxed out two and that's definitely going to help me in this UK challenge here specifically. Uh, so that's nice. And that we managed to uh, to get some use out of them too. If I don't get use out of them elsewhere, at least I've gotten some use out of them here, you know. That is fine. Round number 8 coming up. Almost halfway through. And I must say no major problems whatsoever so far. I hope many of you guys got through it. It's looking quite easy. Oh wow, I didn't even read that that was gravel. I'm so sorry. Uh... I think most of you guys can probably get through this one um, because it is looking quite very easy. Oh no, now I don't have a rainy one on the twisty road, but it should be fine. Um, I feel as if though this challenge is made for everyone to be able to do it. And then the other challenge is the more difficult one that not everybody will be able to do. Um, that is another dirt. Oh uh, yeah, I'll just put it on, this on the test bowl, should be fine. And then I'll put uh, that there, that there. Um, oh, that's a test bowl I can't win right now. Okay, that's very interesting. Okay, let's figure this out then. Ah, figured out. I have a lot of good cars for uh, th these uh, rounds here. 
I think for British Old Guard, I'm quite set too. I think I have quite a lot of them upgraded even higher up. So if there is like an elite challenge with UK, which there probably will be, I should be quite nice, right? Yeah, I have... Yeah, you can see I have quite a selection here. It's not the biggest one, right? But I have a few epics, which will probably help me out quite a lot for it. Um, that can go there. But then again, I kind of want that here. So I'll plonk this one here. This one here. We have another drag though. So we need to swap out this guy now for something that is gonna go quick. Yeah, there we go. And that can go there. And then we'll have this one on fast circuit. And I guess it will surely win there anyway. So, but yeah, this is the first kind of difficult round. I guess I want to watch this a little bit here. So we win this. Uh, we should win this. So we do. And we win this. It's definitely harder than the German challenge we had before this. That's that's something I have to say. But it's probably going to be heavily doable for pretty much everyone anyways. I, I could not see like at least a somewhat, you know, competitive garage should have no problem with this, hopefully. Um... Uh, Okay, well now we need to buy the tickets, which is totally fine. Okay, so here we have the car park. I feel as though that should work there. Is this medium? Yeah, and so is this, correct? Yeah, so we have the medium lined up, and then that should work there, hopefully. And there we go. Um, yeah. Moving on, round number 12. We're getting ever, ever closer here, ever so closer. Okay, the one mile, I think I'm gonna just keep that guy in. That guy can go on the twisty road. And then I'll keep that guy in for the hill climb, I feel like. But then that guy can win there already. Twisty circuit. I wonder if this could win the twisty This could definitely win the twisty circuit, right? And that wins there. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so here we go. We got it. We got it with the hand we have, which is nice. Uh, we didn't have to swap out any any cars, which is nice because it, that's less hassle for me, of course. Moving on. That is a city street wet, which that should do fine on. Uh, that should also be all good. Uh, that should be all good. That should be all good. And that should be all good. So we are fine here. Um, let's actually watch that city streets because it's quite a fun one to watch I think because our car obviously is way way lower RQ but we should still be totally fine because he doesn't have the tires for this this guy and he doesn't have the handling either you see easy PC but that is medium correct yeah so it's, it had that going for it at least round number 14 here as we move into it uh, I am looking at a easy round again um, which is very nice no problems here and we can move on to the very final rounds almost we are ooh, actually a loss there I wasn't expecting it and that means we didn't progress that's a little little awkward there um, Perhaps we should just plonk in that guy. Yeah, yeah, I have another one of those though. Or we can plonk in that guy and then that guy can just be this guy. Yeah. So boom. Whoops. Oh, but now we don't have... Well, that should be fine. Boom. Oh, we don't have anything for the one mile then. Yeah, so we need to... Never mind. That needs to go out again and we need to get something. City streets and standard tires for this. That is fine. Uh, boom. Uh, boom. 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 Yeah. We're all good. We're all good. A little bit of hassle and we're all all good. Moving on round number 15. This is fusing now. I think we can do without any of the servicing hopefully. Here. Um, that's fine. Um, that's fine. That's fine. That should be fine, and that should be fine, right? We should have this. Yep. Under lock. Round number 16, and we have another car that needs to fuse, but we are not gonna let it. 
Um, and here we have a car park, which that should be fine for, and a city streets medium. I feel as if though this should work here. Then we have a slalom test though wet and the jeepers test wet. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. So, car park. City streets. G4 slalom drag. Does it work? Let's hope so. It's loading. <laughs> it really had to think about this one. Should we allow him to win with this or should we not? This should be good, right? Yeah, that's way, way fine. Um, obviously, the standard tire is so good here. I'm happy I maxed out two of the Caterham too. That is definitely coming in handy here. Um, they are very good though with their 86 handling. So there was like no reason not to max out two. Um, there we go. Very, very nice. 360 zero and we move on to round number 17. We're almost there. Almost there. That's fine there. That's fine there. That's fine there and there. I think there is the better place for it and then that's fine there. We got past number 17, let's watch it. Obviously these final rounds are nice to watch all of them to make sure that we do uh, indeed succeed. This should be fine, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. We just have the standard tires to our advantage there. And this is like basically the same car, right? So. Because we have it upgraded, it's fine. This should be totally fine. He doesn't have standard tires. Um, and this should be totally fine for obvious reasons. The front wheel drive really, really, really limits him as well. Uh, round number 18 moving in now. Uh, again, that's just a mirror. That's fine. That's a mirror. That's fine. We have a fast circuit rainy though. Okay, a fast circuit rainy and a hill climb normal. Okay. Fast circuit rainy and hill climb normal. Hill climb normal. Is that gonna do for the fast circuit rainy? Maybe, honestly. Maybe. Hill climb, we are totally fine though with our TVR. And then we have this, which is totally fine. We just have basically the uh, focus over the Fiesta, you know how it goes. And this should be fine. We have the same car, he just didn't upgrade his. Uh, this is all good because of the uh, rear wheel drive and also, you know, just having the better car. And this one I am very uncertain about. We are all good. Okay. That's interesting. I wasn't sure how that would go, but that was round number 18. Moving on to the coin round now, which is arguably the most important round because this is the round that decides whether or not we uh, manage it. Okay, so we have a drag and the city streets, which is not for this one to do. Okay, let's find out uh, what we can put there for the city streets. Uh, rainy. I mean, I guess that one. So let's just plonk in that too, just to have like the overkill around here. But yeah, I think this should work for the city streets, right? Because he doesn't have the handling nor the tires. So we should, yeah, especially with medium with all of the bends, we are just fine. And this is gonna be an absolute domination. 101 points. This is totally fine as well. So is this. And so is that. Very nice. And now final ceramic pack. Final one of the video. We have a twisty road. We'll keep that one in. We can keep this one for the drag. And then we need three kinda competitive cars, which we can't plonk in, so that's totally fine. We'll plonk in this guy, this guy, and this guy. And we are all good here. So, twisty road, hairpin road, hairpin road, drag, twisty road. And there you have it. 
that's how I beat the challenge. I hope you also beat it. If you didn't, check out my Discord server. You can get some help there. There are over 1,800 members in there already. And there's a challenge talk channel, which you can talk over your hand and see if someone can help you uh, with the challenge. It's also a great resource for top tries overall. So check it out if you haven't already. Link down below in the description. As well as my Instagram page where I post every single max that I do. And also, if you want to support me further, I have a Patreon and a YouTube membership. Now, let's have a look at this ceramic pack. Um, and let's see if we can get anything good. It's a ceramic after all. Might get something good. That is not good though, unfortunately. But we beat the challenge. That's British races for you. And as I said, check out all of those things I talked about. And that is pretty much all I had for you in today's video. Until the very next time, guys, stay safe, have a good one, take care of one another, and goodbye, guys.